the, the, the one that was the hardest to get out of, to, like to go to the restroom? Um, I, think, I think Chris Hemsworth was like, wasn't he bolted into his, I feel like? Perhaps. But when you're in your entire situation, you can't do anything. Correct. Yeah. So I would say probably his has got to be the worst. Oh, probably. <laughs> you weren't sure there for a minute, well, were you? Well, see, every time I look at you, you're wearing a black Sabbath t-shirt, and then all of a sudden, okay. like, I forget all the work that you have to do yes. outside Well, of... I've done a bunch of these movies, so every time we do a new one, I say, do I really have to wear it? Right. Can't you exactly. just paint it on later? Yeah. They, they, no. they can do so much oh, yes. with CGI now. And now, lot. but when you fell, they said you can't, if you go to fall, you can't put your arms out, you'd break your arms? Correct. Why is that? Because yeah. uh, you, you'd be locked into the suit, and then the suit would kind of be okay, and your arms would break inside it. Can you imagine the idea? You, you're thinking about falling, and so instead you go... <laughs> <laughs> and did that happen? Not to me, but to one of the stunt guys it did. I felt like it happened to me. <laughs> <laughs> For my part, my character, she gets to do a lot more in this movie. She wears the Iron Man suit. Now, what was that like? It was great. I loved it. But isn't it complicated to get in and out of? You know, it's not like wearing yoga pants, <laughs> but it's not as bad as the boys make it seem like. Yeah, they act like it's a oh, big my ordeal. <laughs> Don Cheadle and Robert Downey Jr. were like having hot flashes. They were like <laughs> meditating. They were like freaking out. It really wasn't that bad. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Now, uh, for some reason, this outfit at the premiere the other night got a lot of attention that you wore. Did you know? Oh, last night, did it? Yeah, was it? Yeah. Let's take a look at the, uh, the dress. <laughs> Oh, brother. I think there's questions here, and the question to me is... Um, Why is your ass hanging out? Well... <laughs> it just appears you don't see anything in the uh, area where you'd see a... Underwear? That's right. Yeah. Oh, I, I kind of had a disaster. I, 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 I was doing a show, and I, I changed there, and I went, and I couldn't wear underwear. I don't think I can tell this story well, on you, TV. Now you've told it. Well... I, let's, let's just say everyone went scrambling for a razor. <laughs> and so I went from being the most beautiful to the most <laughs> humiliated in one day. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> I really have some questions now. <laughs> you certainly don't take care of yourself if you're... <laughs> I mean, the, the, it was just the side of your leg. What, what, what is going on with you? That... I work a 70s vibe, you oh. know what I mean? Oh, got it. Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't. <laughs> but why are Okay, you... and cut. Let's... <laughs> So you, so, uh, all right. Um, so, <laughs> you got to do your own stunts. <laughs> Let's start. <laughs> How can I get off that, co that topic? That's impossible. <laughs> We're all thinking about that now. <laughs> all right, we'll take a break. And then, <laughs> we'll take a break. Your wife is uh, Spanish, right? Yeah. So yeah. Do the, does the three-year-old, obviously, the one-year-olds don't speak Spanish yet. Yeah, and I don't no. know what's wrong with them. No. They, 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 they can't even walk properly either. Oh, like, no, you know, they can't walk? No, they oh, have to, no. I have to dress them. It's really, they're a bit right. lazy. Um, <laughs> but no, my daughter is, 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 is bilingual. Amazing, like, you walk in the room and if someone's not authentically Spanish and she just won't even have it, you know. She's like, nah, and we'll really? answer in English. Even if, like, my mom or someone attempts to speak in Spanish, she's like, that's, that's horrible. You're butchering the, the language. Get out. Wow, um, a snob. Yeah, a snob, very So much. she speaks both Australian and Spanish, then? <laughs> and English. Yeah, yeah. and English? <laughs> and Three English. languages? I know, isn't that amazing? Wow, that's really impressive. <laughs> the Australian, she's not quite yeah. there. Is it, she, she'll is... grab me by the face, though, like, and she gets frustrated. She'll be trying to describe something in Spanish, and... And I can't even remember the word, but we were at the uh, the nature park the other day, and she's like, "I want to see the pepitos or something." And that's, I know that's not even an animal. Um, <laughs> and I'm like, "I don't know what that is." And she's like, grabbing my face. She's like, "Papa, it's Spanish. It's Spanish." Oh. It's like, I'm sorry. So your kids must be so into the fact that you're Thor. They see you in that outfit. They must think it's really cool. Well, I want them to uh, have their own little costumes. Oh. So awesome. we have. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. 
<laughs> and this is safe for a kid. This is uh, good. Yeah. Um, <laughs> this is the second movie you've done with Chris. Yes. So you should know him by now. I do know Chris pretty well by now, I think. You know that he likes to scare people. <laughs> How did you get her in there? What, what... He didn't. You guys I was it. I was I... told that there's some QVC products in the yeah. bathroom to check out. <laughs> you baited her. Wow. Like, and I was like, oh, is Reese's that why you did pieces. the thing with Julia Roberts the other day? <laughs> oh, my God. All right, let's see what happened. <laughs> I'm sweating. I was oh, really man. cold, and then I walked into the bathroom. Like, uh, <laughs> I have a really bad fight or flight response, I think. No, because you stayed upright. I mean, you, <laughs> you could have gone down. I've seen some videos down. where yeah, people Taylor have Swift went completely yeah, yeah, down. Yeah. I've done that but before in my house before. You started sweating, you said. I did. I was trying to air immediate. this out a little bit. What do you mean? And have you? <laughs> I've been trying, okay. but now I'm nervous. <laughs> I have a really great dog. I did a movie no. last year. The sweetest dog. You rescued it. I did. We did a film, and we one, one of the scenes was in a in a in a shelter, and you kind of walk in and you say, "Are these all real <laughs> shelter dogs?" And and I, I found one that just didn't belong there. No, he I did not. So well, none of them. Look at him. What's his oh, name? Man. Well, well. What's his name? His name's Dodger. He's adorable. He's not as cute as my dog, but he is adorable. <laughs> Your dog's real cute. Yeah. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Come on, horrible. man. You don't make Is me it an ice cream cone? Yes. <laughs> Thank God. I wanted to wait. Uh, muscles, uh, muscle man, right? Muscle? Yeah, 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 okay, yeah okay. man. Okay. Right. Like an ice cream cone. <laughs> Let's talk about Spider-Man. So, ha, were you a fan growing up? Huge fan. A yeah. huge, huge fan, yeah. And how did you find out you got this role? That's a, a huge thing to get this role. <laughs> I basically had been auditioning for about five months. And after my final audition, they said, you'll find out tomorrow. Fast forward six weeks, I was still waiting, still waiting. And one day, Marvel just posted on their Instagram, go to our website to find out who the new Spider-Man is. And that's it. I just found out online. It didn't, they didn't call me up or anything. So I ran downstairs. I was going ballistic. My poor dog, Tessa, was terrified. Um, and my brother, Harry, who's pretty savvy with technology and stuff, was like, dude, they've probably been hacked, bro. Like, they would call you, right? They would let you know. And um, so I called my agents. They were like, oh, this is amazing. And then Kevin Feige finally rang me and said, I've got some great news. You're going to be Spider-Man. I was like, I know, Kevin. You put it on <laughs> yeah. Instagram. Please. Like, I'm wow. 20. Do you really think I'm not going to find it? It's so fantastic. You look great. It's good to see you again. It's good to see you. So, Thank you for having me. What a big year. I mean, you had Black Panther, now you have Us, which, it, I mean, it's, it couldn't get bigger. I heard you did something interesting last year. What did you do? I went on a 10-day meditation retreat. Oh, wow, where? Yeah, it was outside of Dallas. Uh, it's a Vipassana retreat. Uh, I don't know where it was. It was, like, farmland. You go there and, uh, you know, you sign away your electronics and and you promised to stay the 10 days and uh, and it was the hardest thing I have done really uh, so aside you from us yeah but you do you speak or you don't No, speak? it's complete silence uh, for 10 days you're allowed to ask questions at specific times of day uh, but it's you're not allowed to make eye contact with the other uh, people on the retreat because the idea is for you to have a solitary experience and really just face your own demons. So all that silence, no, no electronics, no music, no TV, nothing. Just you and your thoughts. And boy, did I learn a lot about my thoughts. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, silence is a really powerful thing. I, I believe in that. Cool. And at the end, did you, like, did you get to look at people and then kind of learn about them, or? Well, you know, it was funny. Right before we started, before you, the silence is official, some woman came up to me and she was like, are you Lupita Nyong'o? And I was like, oh, damn. Oh, no. I came all this way to get away from right. that. And then afterwards, she came up to me and said, you know, I'm so sorry, I realized 
after this 10 days that that was the one thing you were probably escaping from. And I appreciated yeah. that. You know? She was probably the whole 10 days going, God, I'm an idiot. Why did I do that? <laughs> That's the whole time, just by herself. Oh, she's going to hate me. <laughs> but I'm going to go up to her at the end, and I'm going <laughs> to That's all she had going on. Um, there's some crazy tattoos that oh. fans have gotten. Yeah. Like, the entire back. I've seen some of the them. The entire back? Yeah, there's yeah. one. Uh, well, there's what? One. Oh, no. Yeah. Wait a second. No. On a hand? And Wait a second. Oh. Look at that. Wait, I'm on someone's back? Yeah. That looks like the bride of Chucky. Do Get you know out yeah. of the here. Yep. Yeah. That face is, oh. Oh, snap. That's my resting face. Yeah. <laughs> that looks banana. I know. Not, that one's not bad. I mean, that's beautiful. What's in the middle of my forehead? Oh, that's uh, someone's skin. That's someone's yeah. skin, yeah. That's someone's mole that's now on your forehead. They just forehead. incorporated it. Yeah. Wow, my nose looks crazy. That's oh, good. my God. That's not bad. What's the weirdest thing that you've seen? Wow, that was really merchandise? good. You look hot in that one. Wow. I mean, I feel like a new sense of pressure, like as a person to like not be a giant embarrassment to someone, because that's going to be a lot of work to cover up if. Uh... Yeah. I think it looks good. I yeah. like it. Yeah. Maybe another actress comes along that looks similar to that, and they don't have they to change it. They could just paint over. Yeah. yeah. And they I could... feel like you could turn that into like Angelina Jolie as Maleficent, like very easily. So that's fine. For sure. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Okay.